So a common question people have with iTunes is how do you get back music that you purchased in the past but no longer seem to have in your library. Maybe for instance you've bought a new Mac and you never bothered to download those songs to it. But once you've made a purchase in iTunes you can now re-download that music whenever you want even if it's years later. So how do you do it? Well, The first thing you want to do is you want to go to the account menu and make sure that you're logged on using the same account that you made the purchase. If you've changed Apple IDs you're not going to have access to the music you purchased in your old Apple ID. That's why it's important to have one Apple ID per person and stick with it. Then you want to go to the music section. Once you go to the music section over here you want to look for the store button at the top and you go to the store. Now you look on the right here and this is where you'll find a link to things that you've purchased in the past. This is where a lot of people get tripped up because they think it should be in some menu up here. But you click on Purchased and it will load in all of your previous purchases. You can see them uh, sorted here by artist. You can switch between albums and songs. You can switch between everything you've ever purchased or things that you've purchased but are currently not present in your library. And you can search for something over here. So you can see after 10, 15 plus years of purchasing things on iTunes I've got a lot here. And I can select anything I want and simply download it again. So um, you can see here the little cloud icon. If I click on it uh, it will go and download that song. And You can see the cloud icon is now gone meaning that I have that in my library now. So if I were to switch between all and not my library you can see now that disappeared because it is in my library currently. And that's how you download something you've purchased in the past. You can also Look over here in the top right and you can see that you can switch to movies, TV shows, apps that you purchased in the past and even audiobooks that you purchased through iTunes. So you can read down all, all those things very easily from this screen here and add them back to your library. You can do this in iOS as well. Just go to the iTunes Store app on your iPhone or iPad. Tap on More at the bottom right. And then you can dig down and find the song that you want and tap it to download.